When a flower market is opening in London, you and I, we need to be there. I'm currently on my way from East London all the way to Chiswick in West London, where Chiswick flower market is opening at 9.30 today. It's currently about 8.30, so it should take me about an hour, so we will be there just in time. And as usual, I'm very excited to show you the flowers, the plants, and go shopping. Let's do it. Okay guys, here we are, so you can see the market behind me there. It was a surprise to me that you have to wear a mask. Obviously it's really good, don't get me wrong, I really support it. Uh, but because it's outside and normally in London at the moment you don't have to wear a mask when you're outside. But I think because it is quite busy, a lot of people start to arrive, it's definitely safer. So you have to wear a mask, you have to sanitize your hands and then you can go in and shop. And that is exactly what we're gonna do right now. So the first shop behind me here is a specialist herb grower. That is right up my street. You've got basil, you've got coriander, you've got rosemary, and it smells fantastic. There's not only one herb per type. There's literally three or four different herbs. So there's like a sweet spearmint, normal mint down here. Then there's lime mint for mojitos. So this is literally a herb fan's heaven. I love it. I found a new stand which I think is super interesting. So this is Life Like Flowers and actually what's your name? Hi, my name's Monica. <laughs> and you're the owner? Uh, I work with the uh, business here. Okay, so yeah. could you explain to my viewers what everlasting flowers from Life Like Flowers are? I mean, we see them here in the background, but I guess sure. what makes them eco-friendly? Uh, sort of, exactly, yeah. so all of our flowers um, last for two years. They don't need any water. They're either dried or preserved. Okay. So if they've been preserved, um, they've been treated in a lab with natural sugars and oils to stabilize them. Amazing. So they uh, just are like frozen in time and you just leave them in their bars and that's it. I love it. Okay, well, thank you very much. Thank you. So here we are. I did buy a bouquet. To be honest with you, I'm super excited because this is something very unique. I really haven't seen that much before and look how beautiful and springy it is. I have to be honest, I did pay, I think, 50 pounds for this, which at first you think is very expensive, but to be honest, if they were fresh, you probably would be paying the same price and they're gonna last forever, which I really, really love. So I'll put the link to the shop for you guys down below so you can check it out. And um, shopping is not done. <laughs> So there's a whole other road in front of me now, which is super long. So this is definitely much, much bigger than Columbia Road Flower Market, which uh, I will link the video for you here. It's very old, <laughs> but yeah, it's probably three or four times the size. And right now, definitely not as crowded, which is quite nice. Coriander? Yeah. So that's a normal one. And here you've got the microgreen coriander. Mm. So what's happened is actually they're 40 times more nutritious than the, the real vegetables. Well, the grown vegetables, yeah. I can say. So each of our seed packets are kind of like built for... I've got really nervous, sorry. Your uh, face is not in it, so... Oh, fine, fine. <laughs> um, uh, yeah, so each of them are designed to kind of like make it really easy to grow. Yeah. So you've got like um, the light conditions, the pots, the plants, what to grow it with, when to grow it, and things like if it's dog or cat safe. And why is it only for kids? Oh, it's not. So <laughs> these, I was like, I want one. <laughs> yeah, exactly. These are the seed, these are the ones for kids. So these yeah. Each and then become. these are, uh, these are for anyone. Okay, so I bought an alien plant and I bought some micro herbs and I also bought some grow your own garden plant kits as I'm sure you've seen I will show you all of that in detail at home I will see you then all right hello welcome to my kitchen so we've got this beautiful bouquet here that I showed you and then here is my alien plant <laughs> This is what it looks like. I love it so much. Uh, it really does look a little bit like an alien. Essentially, it's a succulent, so it's really easy to care for. <gasps> oh, all the stones have gone in here because it's decorated with stones. And then obviously I got this uh, these micro uh, greens. And then also I think you saw, I got this Moroccan spam and, and this Cosmos for our balcony. So I'm gonna uh, put these in a vase, I think. Three hours later, here they are. I think it's so beautiful. I can't really actually wait to have these in the flat and for them to bring me joy every day. 
There's one other thing, however, that I've got, which I wanted to show you. So obviously these are the pea um, microgreens, not to show you, actually to taste. I wanted to do a live taste test. So I'm sure you heard the guy. It's just like apparently super intense pea flavor because they're young shoots, I think. All right, so I'm literally just gonna try them like this. Let's see. Yeah. Really surprising because at first you feel like you're eating some random grass or herb, but it's a very peppery pea flavor. So you know how peas normally taste kind of soft and, and mild? This is pea flavor, but peppery. So really, really intense, almost like a pea essence, which I really love. So I'm gonna put them on my lunch now. Here's actually a view of my lunch. <laughs> so you can see that as well. because I'm gonna do that in a minute now. And I want to say thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. This is gonna go on my things to do in London playlist. I've got loads of other stuff here in the corner for you to watch and get inspired by, please do not forget to subscribe. I know I say it every time, but it's so, so important. You're not gonna believe how important this is for me, so please do it for me, and um, that's it. I will see you very soon. Bye-bye.